Hello everyone, have you got your tea? So today I am doing that every room is a different budget challenge and I have seen this done a few times and everyone's kind of done it differently. I'm gonna give myself either between one and 20,000 smillions or one and 10,000 smillions. We'll see which one's more of the challenge and I will go for that. If you wanna keep watching, please give this video a like, subscribe if you're new and let's build this challenge. <laughs> Hopefully it'll go okay. Okay, so for the first one, we get 1,489 simoleons, exactly. Okay, so I've given us 1,489, and this is going to be the living room. Ooh, I don't remember using those fairy lights. Oh, I love them. Does anyone ever actually keep an eye out on how much things cost in The Sims? Oh, fuck. We've got 1,389 left to build the living room. That's £88 for bloody white. Wait, what have I spent £8 on? No, 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 no. Oh, we can't afford a fireplace. Oh, that's 600 simoleons for that. Baby dot move objects. Thank you. I mean, this is getting... Oh my god, 600 simoleons. Right, we need a tally. Oh, we can't afford a tally. Oh, it's gonna have to be the penguin one. Pingu go on top of it. There we go. Beautiful. We need like some sort of lamp in the corner, you know, make it cozy. We can't afford the lamp. Kids floor up. Oh god, what are you like? What's that? <gasps> More wall lights. Oh my god, how have I not seen these before? We're putting them in. Can we add posters to Oh, <gasps> we can. Oh my god, how have I not seen this before? That's so cute. I'm having the best time. I need something on this wall. I feel like this wall's so empty, but we've only got 50 simoleons left. And we can barely afford any plants. Right, I might get no i can't get right i'm the carpet's got to go it's 65 more pounds we've got 48 oh no we can't have that oh that's really sad we have, we'll have a little plant we can afford a plant oh my god we literally can't afford a posters beautiful right we've got six simoleons left what how much are you you're five i kind of want to use six exactly but honestly i don't even know what is six we can't even afford a box of tissues, that's so sad. I knew this would happen. I knew I'd get en barely any money for like the living room or the kitchen or anything I want to spend money on. But when it comes to a bloody bathroom, I can guarantee I'll get bloody 10,000 simoleons. I just see it happening. I've got one simoleon left, so I'm going to leave it like that. Oh, look at that. I love that. That is staying on there. Wow, now that is what you call style. The roofing on this is gonna be a bitch, I won't lie. Okay, so the next room we're gonna do is the kitchen slash dining room. So how much have we got? 7,920. Oh, we can build a nice one. 536, oh my God, why are these so expensive? Okay, I'm just gonna go like that. It's gonna be a small kitchen, small room, and they're gonna have to deal with it. Oh, bloody hell, I need to unlock them. Ooh, that's pretty, although it's bloody big, isn't it? Do I like that floor? I mean, I honestly, I don't know if I do like it. Oh, I like that. That's nice and dark. I literally said I'm not going to build a dark house. I'm going to go for light. And here I am, bloody doing dark again. Oh, no. It's getting to that point where we can't afford things. I'm not liking this. A grand for a cooker of 400. We're going for the yum yum. Oh, I thought things were going too well. Damn it. It's nearly lunchtime and I'm bloody starving and I feel like this is going to make me more angry when things aren't going to go away because in reality I just need to eat but I just want to keep playing. Bloody hell, I don't know what's wrong with me today. I'm saying that things in base game are nice. Wow, never expected that to happen. Right, I'm calling it. I'm going to have some eggs and I will be back in a bit. Eight hours later. I got another cup of tea. Can I build a house without using the Harry Potter pack? Apparently not anymore. How much is an iPad? A thousand! Oh! I mean, just for that little square thing. <gasps> 45 simoleons exactly. Right, we're having some books on the table. Oh, I've got to zero. I swear that never happened. 2,889 simoleons. Right, okay. That's like, that is a decent amount for a bathroom. 1,889 simoleons. Should I do like that? And it, oh, that could be a look, couldn't it? I love that light from Get Famous. It's so obnoxiously big. 
50 quid for a bath mat. Oh my god. Okay, 84 simoleons. What else do we need? We need some hand wash, you know, get rid of that corona. All right, we've got four simoleons. I don't even think there's anything we can buy for four simoleons. This challenge is testing my patience. Okay, so this is going to be like a kid's room. So let's see how much money we've got. 5,568 for a kid's room. Oh god, okay. Let's make it super pink and girly and cute should we give her a princess chair why not they have the money <coughs> oh bless you i feel like that is ridiculously big oh we could have a little harry potter one i'm sorry i really need to stop i just love this pack so much i mean how can you not so awkward trying to find an even number Does she really want that in her room <gasps> Oh, there's a pink one. Yes, she does. Well, two simoleons left. Right, I think that's a good one. I think I'm going to leave that room there. Okay, let's move on to the second bedroom. 9,107 simoleons. Wow. Is this a challenge, though? I mean, I'm giving myself a lot of money. Should I make it, like, 5,000 simoleons? Okay, I'm taking it down to five. 3,812. Okay, I'm not even going to say what this bed pack is from because I feel like someone's going to shout at me in the moment. <laughs> so we're going to try something new and try new colours and see how it goes. Oh, is that a bit blue though? I love it. This sim can be so into his fashion. Okay, we can't actually afford a poster so I've made the postcard real big. And we've got seven simoleons left, right. We can't afford a plant, that's so sad. We can afford this bloody thing though. But I mean, does he really want that? Right, I think this room is complete. Let's move on to the master bedroom and I will do the ensuite as a separate room. Okay, should we do the bathroom first or the bedroom? Let's do the bathroom because I've already done two bedrooms. Right, how much do we get for the bathroom? £1,401. Okay. I don't know if we are going to be able to afford nice things. Right, okay, I'm going to put a bath in here. Oh god, we can barely afford baths. I really don't think we've got enough money for walls and things. Am I going to have to go for white again? I'm not going to go for white again. I'm going to try something new. I quite like this white tiles, you know. That's nice. I know it's white, but it looks very fresh, doesn't it? Is it weird to have the toilet roll like that side? There we go, a nice white one. Oh, we can hang it on the back of the door. Oh! <gasps> I didn't know you could do that. Yes, that's great. Did I say I was not going to do white in the bathroom? I did. Do I care that I haven't? No, not really. I think it looks pretty. Do we just put a really sad flower on the floor? Oh, there we go. That's beautiful. So I'm going to leave the bathroom there. Right, on the last bedroom of the house, let's see what we get. 3,507. Is that a good amount? I don't even know. Why can't I find a swatch I like? Bloody base game. Is this too big for it? <gasps> it's perfect size. It does block the window though. I mean, it probably looks nice on the outside. So we're going to keep it up there. I keep forgetting that I have an actual budget and I'm really not good at staying on it because I've literally got 1,400-ish simoleons. <sighs> It's not going good. Oh, I'm bloody blocking the bathroom door. <sighs> That's annoying. Like, look at the size of that. I mean, what are you having at night on there? You know, you want your drink and you want a little light. That's all you need. You don't need anything else. Maybe a book. Depends if you're reading Harry Potter for the millionth time again, like me. That's cute. Ish. I was going to say, should we give them a tally? But no, they can't afford one. A little butterfly picture. Beautiful. And we've got 400 simoleons left. This literally looks like it's been in a fight. We've only got 34 simoleons now. Right, I'm going to put a plant on it. Oh, and that's worth 30. Why won't you go in the middle? Right, okay, let's walk through the house and see what we're dealing with. So this is the outside of the house. I really like the outside. I think it's really pretty. And I do like making the houses prettier on the outside because then you've got the inside and you're like, oh my god. Although in this case, it isn't actually that bad. And then you come in through and you go straight into the kitchen, which isn't too bad. I can't remember how much... Um, budget we got to spend on this but you know what it turned out pretty well except for the yum yum cooker i mean we won't talk about that if we come into here into the living room we can see the sims you know enjoying the pingu telly i mean someone has to what are they even watching i don't even know and then we've got the wall of wonder 
I mean, I could replace all of that. I probably should. Look at the giant one. I love that. And then if you come back through the kitchen, you've got one of the bathrooms here. This turned out pretty nice. It's got that giant mirror. Oh, God, it's blocking a window. I added windows at the end, and now, oh, no. Okay, I definitely need to re... The toilet roll. Oh, God. Okay, so I might have screwed things up a little but you know the sims are happy and once again that's all that matters see she's having a bowl of cereal loving life looking out all the beautiful windows and then if you come up the ladder because stairs are too expensive and wouldn't fit you've got the first bedroom here which is a really cute spoiled girls bedroom because we had a lot of money to spend on this although i forgot about the computer and got that last so she got a really I wouldn't say cheap because there's 800 simoleons. Why is that floating? Oh, because I size it down. I mean, that's a bit weird. She's got a Henry Puffer bed set, her Henry Puffer poster. And I put a window on there again. Oh, I mean, I was... I mean, I was trying to make the outside look pretty and I completely forgot about the inside. But you know what? It's okay because she got a really nice bedroom. Back through to the tiny landing, I won't lie into the teenage boys room who's really into his fashion got his pride flag there he's really clever as well though but you know likes to look good while doing so and he's got loads of windows to look out of in the hallway into the master bedroom which is yellow i don't like the floating i forgot to resize them oops but I don't know why I went for yellow. I forgot curtains, but to be honest, there's a tree in front of it. So do they really need it? I ran out of money as well for that. I honestly don't know why I went for yellow, but I mean, yellow and black is pretty cool, isn't it? They've got their own little massive wardrobe there and they've got their own ensuite, which I also did separately money-wise. They've got a little plant on the floor and, you know, a nice bath. I don't know what that is, but... And they got, obviously, the Henry Puffer stuff. But anyway, that is the challenge completed. I hope you enjoyed this. It was really fun to do something new. I love these challenges. They always make me build new things. But, but yeah, if you did like this, please give this video a like. Subscribe if you're new. I will leave links to all my other challenges down below. I also play Harry Potter as well, so I'll leave a link to all the playlists down below. I've completed all years now, up until Goblet of Fire. So they'll all be there for you. And I will see you again very soon. Bye.